ignorance is not an excuse. Because you got God's word. You got the Holy Spirit. Ask the guy next to you, have you got the Holy Spirit? If you got the Holy Spirit, you've hardened your heart and you do not hear the voice of conviction anymore. Whose mistake is that? You know, you sin a couple of times, you steal from work computers, etc., and cetera, you steal a couple of things from work. The more you steal, the less you will hear the voice of conviction. And after a while, you, you will even say that it's your right to take something from work because they don't use it there. That's how the way Satan is working with you, and that's the way sinful nature is working. A man might reckon, my wife don't give it to me at home. And he suss out other women. You know what suss out? Huh? He suss out other women. And he might say, I, I did not sleep with them. But Jesus said, if you look unto a woman, to lust after her in your heart, you have committed adultery. But you say, I did not sleep with her. But Jesus said, you committed adultery. Adultery is not getting into bed and have sexual intercourse with a woman. Adultery is eyeing a woman. And not for our work life. And sent her a couple of WhatsApps and Facebook. And after a while, you enjoy this woman more than you enjoy your wife. You have committed adultery already. Jesus said so. Jesus doesn't didn't say you got to sleep with her before you committed adultery. He said, if you look unto a woman and lust after in your heart, lust, not sleep, lust. I say not sleep, lust. Not meditating that you sleep with her. I say just lust. You've committed adultery. When do you lust after a woman? Well, if you enjoy a woman's fellowship more, another woman's fellowship more than you enjoy your wife's fellowship. You are already in adultery. Now you don't, you don't want to hear what a pastor is saying to you. You have started to justify your evil behavior. And sin is a thing that grows. And before long, you're going to look more, and you're going to look more, and you're going to look more. And before long, you're going to enter pornography, etc., etc., and before long, you're in trouble. And before long, your heart is not completely going to belong to your wife, but to a couple of other women that you meet on Facebook, on WhatsApp. Ask the guy next to you, what's up? Pray, Lord Jesus Christ, grant me grace to take my stand in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord Jesus, grant me grace not to compromise. Say to the guy next to you, do you understand your need of forgiveness? You can never receive forgiveness if you do not understand your need for forgiveness. Amen. And you will never understand your need for forgiveness as long as you justify yourself. Pray, Lord Jesus, have mercy on me and grant me the grace never to justify myself in any way in Jesus' name. Say to God, if you sin is sin, wrong is wrong, and right is right. And God's word is God's word in Jesus' name.